Ready? I'm ready. Are you recording? I am recording. Okay. <laughs> so we've had peacocks for a little over a year now. Of course, we have chickens, up for, like, clearly. And I've, I've been kind of watching their behavior and we let them out of their original, we, we, we kept them off the ground, like we were explained we were supposed to do for the first six months. Then we let them out of that enclosure and let them just hang out with all the chickens and all the rest of the animals. And I certainly noticed that at night they wanted to go up in the trees. So when we would go to put the chickens away at night, make sure all the animals were safe, I was always looking for the peacocks trying to figure out where they were and I would look in all the trees until we would locate them and sometimes I couldn't find them so I would ask Sandy to come and find them for me just to make sure that we had them here and then of course they turned a year old and decided to leave for a while which we were able to get them back and I thought how could we build an enclosure how could we build something a little bit more natural so that they could feel that they were in the wild, not that they're in the wild, but a little bit so. And that's what we ended up with behind us. I decided to encompass a bunch of trees. Under these evergreens, there's this really cool canopy. And the idea was, what if we enclosed 12 feet up into the trees and circled it, connected our fencing slash wire slash four by six two by whatever it is up two levels which is 12 feet that would be a really great enclosure for them but what I had noticed is when they roost they want to roost as high as possible in the trees and, and the average I had been watching they were roosting I don't know 16 18 20 feet in the air well Trying to screw this wire into trees 20 feet in the air is kind of crazy. So instead I had this idea. I had found this thing on the side of the road. I picked it up. It's like a canopy that the kids played on. Like a monkey gym, monkey bar sort of octagonal thing. I decided, what if we put that at 12 feet up in the air? Which was what you're going to see there. I wrapped it in wire so they couldn't get out. I had some of the young folks around here help me hoist it up there. We supported it up. So now the peacocks can go 12 feet in the air, roost on a bar, and have a canopy that's four or five feet above them. So they can feel that they're way up in the air and not be so close to the ground because they want to get way up in those trees. And that's what we did. We just wrapped two six foot layers up gave us 12 feet ran two by fours around at 12 feet with some cross members for support and then went up from there that canopy probably goes that that octagonal thing probably goes up five feet we wrapped that with uh chicken wire with kind of whatever we had to keep them in and we put a roost bar right at 12 feet so they can fly up to 12 feet stretch themselves up two or three feet and they feel that they're way up in the air. So this is what we've done and they, the peacocks really seem to be happy by it because with it because they can get up high enough in the air that they feel that they're up, 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 up into the trees. Which they are, they're way up into the canopy of the trees and, uh, and they feel safe there at night.